Today, with a, you know, first it was reported that this was a pipe bomb, and then you know, and it seemed like something that was deliberate, and then we heard that it was accidental. Where did that confusion come from? Uh, you know, the initial reports from the people. You know, they see a pipe sticking out of a roof, and they heard a minor explosion, so they just see assumptions of pipe bomb. And then, uh, you know, I think everybody's sensitive to different issues, you know, domestic terrorism, foreign terrorism, whatever, you know, they're real sensitive to that, so anytime they have an issue like this arise, I think that pops in their mind, and, you know, we were able to investigate, and it wasn't any of those, uh, just an accident. How did you hear about the explosion today? My husband called me this morning. Where were you? I was, I was on actually driving my kids to school. And what did he say to you when he called you? He said that there has been a small explosion, they evacuated everywhere, but everyone's fine, and they were continuing the prayer service, and uh, the whole streets were closed off, but everything's fine. Did he say it was a bomb or an explosion, an accident? So it was a or? small explosion. It was an accident. It wasn't, and, and any, it was, at no point did we know it was a bomb until I found out on radio that that's what they were saying. And I got calls from family and friends asking if everything's okay. But right away they knew it was just a small explosion. How did the rumors start that it was a bomb? I'm wondering the same thing. I don't know. At what point did you guys become certain that it wasn't deliberate? Um, probably an hour into it. An hour into it? And what gave you that idea? Once I mean, the sheriff's bomb squad entered in and took a look at it, and they were certain that it wasn't anything anything suspicious or anything dangerous. And at this point, the police department is not labeling it as terrorist or any threat to the Chabadas.